Hello, everybody, and welcome to Mentoring Moments with Judy Jacobs. Let me tell you something. Dream big. We're here in my kitchen here in uh, Cleveland, Tennessee, and I found this and I thought, I'm just going to remind somebody today to dream big. Dream big. Why dream big? Because you serve a big God. God wants to blow your mind with dreams that you have given to him, that you have prayed over him. Maybe some things that you've never told anyone else. He wants to let you know, I am here to see your dreams come to pass. What is the verse of scripture? Because the word is our final authority. Call unto me and I will answer thee and I will show you great and mighty things that you know not of. That's just another way that Jeremiah said, just dream big. Joseph was a dreamer. Are you a dreamer? I want to tell you, God wants you to dream, but he wants you to dream mammothly. I don't even know if that's a word, but he wants you to dream big because he is a big God. When you consider how he flung the stars in the sky and he named them all by name, surely he knows your name today. And he's telling you, come on, don't give up on your dreams. Don't give up on your aspirations. Don't give up on the purpose. Even the reason why he puts you on this planet. Dream, but when you dream, dream big. Dream and let God do the impossible. Ephesians 3.20, now unto him that is able to do exceeding abundantly above all that you can ask, think about, even dream or imagine. Can you imagine all the things that's in your prayer journal? Can you imagine all the things that you've asked God for this past year of 2018? And I want to encourage you and I also want to challenge you today in this mentoring moment to never forget to keep your dreams alive. God honored Joseph's dreams and just like that, he went from the pit to the palace. And I hear the Lord saying today, tell them to dream big because I'm getting ready to do a transfer. I'm getting ready to take them from a place that's in a pit, a place that they think they will never come out of. If you'll just keep consistent and asking, because the Bible says if you ask, it will be given unto you. If you seek, you will find. And if you knock, the doors will be open. He wants you to keep asking. He wants you to keep seeking. He wants you to keep asking because if you just keep on being consistent, if you'll just keep on being stable in Him, if you'll stay in church, if you'll stay in the Word, if you'll stay on your knees, if you'll stay in the loving presence of God, you can dream big and you can know with it beyond the shadow of a doubt. This is the confidence that we have in God, knowing that if we ask anything, According to his will, he hears us. And then we know that if he hears us, then we have those petitions that we have asked of him. What is the biggest thing that you've ever asked God for? I want to encourage you and I want to challenge you. Can you dream bigger? Can you ask God for bigger? He's waiting. Not just, Lord, you know, take my headache away or, or Lord, uh, can you just pass my exam? Or, or Lord, no, he wants you to ask infinitely beyond your wildest dreams or imaginations. That's what the word says. Can you do it? I know you want to. I know it's inside of your spirit. And the spirit is always willing, but you got to open up your mouth and you got to declare today, I'm going to dream big. And tomorrow, just like Joseph, I'm going to see it. I'm going to see it with my eyes. I'm going to touch it with my hands. And I'm going to know that God is a God that answers prayer. He answered, he answered Joseph's prayers. He answered Elijah's prayers. I mean, why? Really, really? Calling fire down from heaven? What do you, what do you believe in God for today? What is it that you're asking God to do something big? Just like Elisha, he says, I want double. You want double today? Ask him. Remember, it's your opportunity to dream big.
I'm so glad that you've joined me today for Mentoring Moments. Just a little snippet, just to get you over, get you to another place in God. And I've enjoyed coming to you today. And if you've enjoyed it, I want you to go to judyjacobs.com and subscribe to be a part of our email. And I believe these little snippets every single day are going to take you to a higher level and a deeper depth. Come on, come on this journey with me and let's travel together and see what God's going to say to us. God bless.